Hi, it's Double1975, and today I'm bringing you a PUBG video on Xbox One. Uh, this was a fun opening bit. Basically, Woody died, and as you saw, I jumped through the window of a shotgun after it died, just to see what sort of carnage and mess I could make of Hacienda before uh, suiciding myself to join Woody back in the lobby. Um, I was quite chuffed, actually. I got a decent amount of kills with my shotgun. I could have got a bonus one here. I think there's a guy uh, knocked down there that I could have probably claimed before. Uh, ending up in this gunfight uh, but anyway so I got three legit kills and um, steal someone else's kill by killing a crawl guy crawling around for the fourth um, but it was fun getting a bit of revenge on uh, the people who killed Woody and uh, some other teams that were there but I'm actually bringing you some opening kills from various games and I always find how I how that opening kill goes defines the entire game for me whether I feel like I have a good or a bad game is really dependent on that first kill. Sometimes that first kill's well worked out, well planned, aggressive, bold, you know, um, and a sensible move. Other times it's the dumbest, stupidest things. Um, sometimes you're really well equipped for the first fight you get into. Uh, sometimes you've got no equipment whatsoever. And it's how that first get kill goes. Uh, tends to set the tone for me. I'm always one I like to get into a fight as soon as possible I like to get that first kill under my belt as soon as possible and I'll quite often you know Bust into houses and engage people who are well dug in on the basis that I just want that first kill under my belt As you can see it just always makes me feel better um, But sometimes like I say sometimes it's well worked out Sometimes you're aggressive you're bold you push you you, know, you really rush other times it's the craziest most stupidly panicky um, you know moments um, the amount of gameplays I brought to you where my opening kill was a pan killing someone or you know some sort of craziness uh, other times it's just you know you're so poorly equipped and they're so well equipped here I'm up against the guy with a mini 14 and a shotgun didn't know that when I'm taking him on with my pistol I just knew he's gonna have a better gun than me um, so when I realized he had a shotgun, I was like, do I keep my distance or not? Because I'm using a pistol. I don't really want to put too much distance between me and me and him, but then I don't really want to be a range where that's going to kill me in one hit. I think I judged it just about perfect. And this one is the fun clip of the lot. Um, <laughs> this guy, fair play to him. That's what you should be doing is grabbing a pan and coming at the person. Uh, especially when you drop somewhere like this, which is pretty remote and doesn't have the most loot. Um, you know. Uh, but this guy didn't quite pan out for him, uh, pun intended. But that's all for this video. Thank you very much for watching.